I just got this in. Let's open it up and see what we got. The Holly EFI. This is the Terminator X. Uh, 650 horsepower. Got some decals. Terminator X. Okay. Got two separate boxes. in black that looks good Looks a lot like a regular carburetor. I'm not sure where the discharge is for the injectors. I saw on YouTube that some of the some of them had a ring around the bottom where the injector came out, but I don't see these. Hmm. You can see the can see the injectors in there and they look like they just run straight in that's probably about a 6 a.m. fitting I have to see if it hooks up to my fuel rail and it's got vacuum port at the back and then a bigger one it's got two two at the i guess this is the front no it's got two at the back a small one and a bigger one and then then one at the front and there's your tps sensor Yeah, that looks good. I like that black. Kind of got like a black matte finish on it. I think I see some little discharge holes in there. It's on top of the throttle blades though. It might be a newer design. Some of them were, look like they were underneath the throttle blades. But these are right above the throttle blades. I don't think it's going to show up in the camera. But there's 15 tiny little holes above each throttle blade for the fuel to come out of. That's good. Okay, let's open this other box. This 
one should have all the hardware and the ECU in it. ECU. That's a one bar map sensor. That's power and ground and then here's your connectors to the sensors and the throttle body. That's a lightweight little little thing. The reason I wanted the Terminator X was because of the ECU mounted external from the throttle body. I'd seen where some guys had, had trouble with the throttle bodies on the ones that were mounted on the throttle body itself. And here's the wiring harness. Matter of fact, there's a lot of wiring harnesses in here. Here's the input-output harnesses. I guess they're optional. It's to run your electric fans. Uh, you can run your ignition timing. I think there's like four, four different loads you can run off the ECU. And I guess you just gotta wire them in if you want to use them. Anyway, that's that's what I got. We're gonna go into the 21st century and get away from the carburetor. <laughs>